Retro Man Podcast. This is our new theme song. That's pop pop. Anyways, hey, welcome. Uh, episode sixteen of Next Gen Retro Man Podcast. I am Ryan, as always. I'm Jason. Yep. I'm Adrian. Yep. Say so, yes, we're all we're all still here. Okay. Yeah. We haven't. We haven't contracted COVID nineteen. <laughs> so have you? Yeah. Send us a message. Let us know. But don't. If you, if you don't have, send us an email. Yeah. You know the uh, North Star Mall is shut down. Yeah. Well, they they should have done to clean it. To clean it, because yeah. the some lady that was in quarantine got released. Yeah. She's dropped her off at the mall. Yeah. And then like one of the tests yeah. came up positive. Yeah. It was really stupid. Yeah, anyways. Well, yeah, I'm in Dallas. News. Good luck, oh, guys. That was the news. Yeah, other than that, what's been going on, Adrian? Uh, lots of crap. <laughs> Speaking of sicknesses, uh, my daughter had uh, the flu, her first flu. Oh, we should mark this occasion. Mm-hmm. Where's, you need to make a cake. Yeah, uh, it was the, the the small one, so the same small one that I had like a month ago, so it wasn't, it wasn't too bad. Uh, she knocked her out for a week. Uh, Carrie stayed w- home with her and watched her, so we we're kind of worried that she was going to get sick. So this past week, yes, she did get sick, but not with the flu, it was just sinus infection, so, you know, yeah. that's good. I was going to say, because uh, she just recorded in the same place we were recording right <laughs> yeah, now, got like, <laughs> All four of us were, like, in this cramped little room here. Uh, no, that was, yeah, she wasn't, we're good. She gets, like, a, a yearly kind of allergy thing that turns into bronchitis sweet yeah so that's awesome the car repair guy called and said need more money and more time so we called the insurance people on the other end and they said okay so still six weeks later and still doing that very nice that's from that that's from that thing crashing down on top of it right yeah the whole the car garage God, that was forever ago. I'm so sorry. Yeah. So I, was, I mean, is it a nice rental car? It's a nice rental car. So I'm not like, like a Ford funny. Fiesta or something. No, it's it's got a little push button start thing and oh. cameras oh. everywhere. Yeah. I mean, I'm not complaining, but like, you know, it's high quality car. life right there. I'm just, you know, worried that I'm gonna do something to this car and then I'm not gonna be stuck with that bill. Oh no. Mm, true. Mm. Last week I went to the Mystery Science Theater 3000 tour uh came to san antonio jealous yeah that was <laughs> uh that, that, we got tickets but my daughter of course had the flu so my wife stayed and watched the kid so i had an extra ticket i had to work yep so <laughs> i took my buddy tommy um no it was cool and um what movie was it it was uh no tr- no retreat no surrender it was actually um, John Claude Van Damme. No, oh, sweet. But he was not the main character. He was like the villain that came in for like two minutes in the beginning, and then like the final fight for like five minutes at the end. That sounds awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Uh. It was it was fun, cheesy. If you're not familiar with the Mystery Science Theater, it's uh. You're listening to the wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They sit there and they make fun of movies. <clears throat> yeah. It's it's awesome. It's like. It's like this guy and, and these two puppets, and they just kind of riff pup- at, at like just shitty old movies. Did, were the puppets there? Like, oh, did yeah. they actually ha- like they're actually there? Okay, they're so there. I, I've gone to a riff tracks in the past, and that was a lot of fun. Yeah, that's it's a it's yeah. the same same guys, same right? Guys, same characters. Yeah. Um. Uh. But the I think riff tracks is with Mike. I'm uh, not sure. It was a riff track host. With Forrest Gump. Oh, that see that'd be cool. Yeah, Riff Tracks does more modern movies. But that's with Mike, the second host of Mr. Science Theater. Uh, this one was with the original host, the original creator, uh, Joel Hodgins. But yeah, it was cool. It is, it's just like the, the show. Like they, they go up on stage, do a little skit with the robots. Uh, then they kind of go off to the side in the, like, the little booth. And then up on screen is the, the movie. And they'll just riff on it. And everyone's laughing in the, in the auditorium. And then like they'll like kind of break a little bit like they do in the show, and like kind of do some more skits uh, on stage. That's uh, fun. 
Yeah, it was, it was a blast. I'm really mad I didn't go. <laughs> Thanks, Aww. responsibilities. Yeah. I didn't even get an invite. <laughs> you live in Dallas. <laughs> what else? Oh, over the weekend I saw a Journey cover band with the in-laws. It was, uh, it was, that was fun. Were they good? Yeah, it was, it was really good. They actually. Uh, were you drunk? Uh, yeah. Okay, so they were great. They were great. Yeah. <laughs> journey made and my alcohol makes Journey infinitely better. Uh, makes like any music really, but like cover bands much more so. Yeah, it was it was a lot of fun. A lot of uh, a lot of Journey fans. So like you know, the whole crowd was just singing along and drunk off their ass. So that's fine. It was it was a lot of fun. Uh, what about you, Jason? What have you been up to? Uh, painting Necrons in my kitchen. We finally got our kitchen table. That was really exciting, and we got it, and we didn't get the screws to put it together. So it's kind of like it's like if you stand up wrong, the table just falls apart. So that's did funny. it not come with screws? No, it came with them, but they were like first. Okay, this is the story of this. We got it in like <laughs> segments, but uh, it was being stored at. Her, grace's dad's house and he forgot the table like the legs for it so we just had the top and then he remembered to bring the legs and he we forgot the screws so i had the table on top of the legs and kind of like pushed into their plunges but i didn't have the screws to tighten it and so it's always like a test on is it going to fall down over the night or is it just going to sit there today oh my god yeah so Kill a I like or something. Yeah, I like to have fun playing my Necrons on it, and then if I get up wrong, then they go and fall off. So, but it's the only it's, table we have in the house now. You can go to Home Depot and get <laughs> screws. Get screw. dude. Yeah, I was trying to figure out which ones there are, but I've been working so much, I haven't had time to go to Home Just Depot. Take the take season. a table leg with you, and and they have like things there. Like, seriously, <laughs> I look like a crazy guy walking into. No, Home Depot. like that's that's what, I know. <laughs> that's what Home Depot is for. <laughs> yeah, a crazy I guy with a haven't, table haven't had time going to go on him. Yet. Uh, other than that, like I said, working a lot, a lot, and uh, trying to spend as much time with Grayson as I can. It's his first birthday in a month, so we're trying to plan all that out. So we're trying to get the Jeez. cake ready, and uh, we got I booked a pavilion for everyone to go to for the oh. birthday party for like an hour. But Are you telling people he wants Warhammer stuff for his birth first birthday. <laughs> Yeah, Grayson's really a big fan of the Tyranids. Or table screws. So, uh, but he hasn't had a chance to get any of the Tyranids yet. So if you want to go on to the... I'm just playing. Uh, yeah, he also wants screws for the table. So he can sit there and not worry about things smashing him. Uh, saw a couple good movies because we actually have a video rental store here still. So I go there and I rent movies from there because it's infinitely cheaper than Redbox. And I saw Frozen 2. It's really good. Redbox is a dollar. <laughs> Redbox is not a dollar. For like Blu-rays, it's like four bucks. That's out of my price range. Well, you're just being bougie with your Blu-rays. And most of the time, I can't even find the movies I want at Redbox. I, I, usually, rent off the of, I usually rent off of But like I know YouTube. I'm I also just, you know, you're supporting a local business. That's a good thing. Yeah. yeah. Even though they don't have any Switch games that are any good. Oh, well, fuck those guys. I went there to go rent Super Mario oh, Odyssey yeah. because that's all y'all talk about, and they don't have that. They never have had it. Oh, yeah. Hey, how's, how's Super Mario Odyssey going? That's good. Uh, Carrie took over the baby spot, so she likes it. <laughs> uh-huh. Cool. But yeah, so Frozen 2. Adrian, you liked it, right? Frozen 2, yeah. Um, yeah. I like the music. Everyone's yeah, like going nuts over like the first Frozen, like Let It Go. I was like... Uh, I don't get it. Like, I told my wife like, this one's infinitely better than the first one. Yeah, mu- music-wise, story-wise, I don't, re- I don't remember the first one. It's got an 80s power ballad in it. Yeah. Uh, one... Saw Knives Out oh. also. It's really good. Knives Out's good. And it's really good. And I finally saw the Halloween reboot. I don't watch movies, remember? I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm uncultured. <laughs> it's okay, you read books. I, do, but... I tried reading Dune. <laughs> Got like through the first chapter. I'm like, I hate reading. <laughs> Just buy the audio. Yeah, the audio, yeah. Audio book. Yeah, I need to find a good audio book that uh, is narrated there's by one. a person I like to listen to. There's an uh, there's one at the half price books by my house. Yeah, I've had no luck with half price books in the Dallas area. I just know the ones near us in San Antonio. Someone's traded in like. <laughs> a shit ton of kiss stuff so there's kiss stuff in every <laughs> se- there's like bus and 
kiss bears and dolls and action fit like there's kiss shit everywhere i went to sell some stuff and they were like (laughs) it's not kiss is it (laughs) no it's like some wife that like divorced her husband who's like a huge kiss ass fan or something oh yeah it was pretty funny let me start out of my house yeah no, but and Knives Out is really good. You should watch them. Knives Out. You should watch Knives Out. It's really good. You should watch Jojo Rabbit. I'm working on it. Yeah. I plan I on renting it this it. week. I bet you they do, but I'll have to drive like five hours. To it's YouTube. Just one. YouTube. It's like three bucks. Okay. That's how I rent my movies. I might watch it tonight after we get done. Uh, we're going to start my dog and dog training classes soon because she's become like a tyrant over the week. She started to eat chocolate randomly, like goes and actively looks for it in places that are not like easy to find, like up in counters and on top of tables and things like that. And she's become very protective of toys. And we just want to get this nicked in the butt before Grayson grows up and tries to play with the toy and gets bit. Oh, right. What kind of dog is it? It's a husky. Yeah. 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 And my dog's being a stupid cat and my cat's being awful too like it's just all these animals are driving me nuts this week what about you ryan how how are you doing i'm working a lot yeah (laughs) doing that (laughs) uh and then this is a very tired guy who works a lot just getting ready for uh some busy times where i work so we'll see what happens what's going on there Greg's probably gonna suck yeah, just yeah, we're just getting into the busy season. I started building my Tau army very, very slowly, and I've been reading the codex for them. Uh, feel like I made the right choice. Um, I heard Tau are really with... easy to build. Um, they were harder than the the space yeah, marines just, for I'm sure. Just kidding. They're actually like known to be the hardest besides Tyranids. Yeah, like there is a lot of like extra pieces and choices, whereas the space marines were like, put this here. Glue it down. Move on. Like this is like you can have it like with this arm, or you can use this arm, or you can put it with this gun and this gun or this gun. And so I'm kind of actually excited about that. Like I've been reading a lot, uh, but I'm gonna do Farsight Enclaves and uh, have some fun with that. Apparently they're like good now all of a sudden, and I did not know that when I was like, oh, I want to do Farsight Enclaves, and then I've been just kind of like reading around and watching videos, and apparently they're getting pretty good. So that's yeah, they're exciting. Getting, they By the time patched. I'm ready, they're going to be nerfed. So No, they got patched like just recently. They nerfed the Space Marines and buffed Farsight. Like, yeah, well, no, but this I'm, week. The, they just released like a supplement. So Farsight's like really powerful in there, I know. So they're going to patch it at some point. We'll see. Anyways, I, I don't care either way. I'm going to keep playing because I, I like the style. That's fine. We've been um, playing for like a year, anyways. I am painting the Space Marines, you know, slowly but surely. Uh, just picked up a bunch of extra like little tools and stuff to to build the Warhammer stuff. I got some magnets. I got um, I have a Dremel in the going to be delivered. Like just a bunch of like stuff to kind of just keep building it. I'm just really enjoying all the different aspects of the the hobby so far. So uh, I ran out of models to build, and now I'm just kind of painting it. But I'm sad I'm not building anymore. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, just or just go on eBay and buy some scrap. Start kit bashing. Yeah, I thought about it. Started uh, carving wood. That's what I started doing. Yeah. Whittle by whittle. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, it's gonna be my new catchphrase. Oh, oh. shut up, all of you. Um, <laughs> oh, I never heard that before. <laughs> okay. Anyways. Uh, video game wise, I haven't been playing really anything. I played the Final Fantasy VII demo. Yeah, it was alright. I, I like see. it. Yeah, I mean, I didn't dislike it. It's just I Graphics don't know if good. it sold me on the game or not. Just I, I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. Um, and then I know I was saying I was gonna read like Dune Messiah, but when I was at Half Price Books, like selling some stuff, like I said, kiss I, stuff. Yeah, I was selling my my kiss uh, memorabilia. I found a copy of starship troopers and like I was like you know i've always wanted to read this i've heard it's really good the the movie is kind of it is what it is like you either like love it or hate it like i frankly i love it but it's, it's one very, of the best movies ever it's totally very different than the book at in places and stuff from what i understand so i read like the first like chapter while i was waiting for them to like process everything 
and I picked it up. Like I'm gonna read it. it seemed like I like you know I'm about to play Warhammer, which is like military sci-fi, like hardcore. So why not you know go to like one of the best pieces of military sci-fi fiction? You know, the there, is, there is so Starcraft. Yeah. Yeah, well, StarCraft was supposedly supposed to be a Warhammer 40k, and so was War, uh, WarCraft was supposed yeah. to be Warhammer, like RTS, and then they Lost couldn't the agree on the license and stuff, so they just kind of made it their own thing, so, you know, because Warhammer's been around since, like, the 70s, so. Hmm. Also, good job, uh, Ryan, yeah, on uh, right. editing the whole D&D thing. Yeah, I, yeah, it was... It was fun. Just, I mean, it just. It's long. My, my wife, my wife was annoyed because I was like, <laughs> "Y'all giggle so much, and it makes cutting and editing thing." There's just some abrupt cuts and stuff in there because there was like, no way around it, you know. Or, or like, you'll hear like kids laughing and stuff, and then it cuts out, and then it comes back, and the kids are quiet. It's because we like put them to bed. And, like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, or I'm like, uh, there was a part where like, <laughs> Charlotte like stubbed her toe or something you just hear owie 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 and i heard like, part like in the in the beginning she's you just hear her laugh like <laughs> yeah like it's yeah anyways it was a uh, it was it fun was a editing we should record it like video yeah, that'd be yeah we'll get there i mean you know it just widow by widow <sighs> oh my god is this gonna be a thing now yes i hate both of you <laughs> so much you're welcome so news News. news news uh the batmobile got leaked today or not leaked the guy who's directing it like shared the screenshots have you seen it adrian yeah kind of looks like a it's a big ass hot wheel yeah <laughs> i have not seen it i think it's like the most realistic looking batmobile it's a muscle car that they suit more up. than the tumbler yeah yeah no yeah the tumbler no like the tumbler is something like that's not gonna happen tumblers like goofy. this one this Hold one's on. like yeah they can they can do this one this is like a mustang that they took a uh, pieces of it off and put on red neon lights yeah hold on i got it right here it looks like the uh 1960s almost yeah not. that's what i was about to say yeah it looks like the uh Adam like West. a realistic car that's like just a, souped up like a, a new version of the the old 1960s batmobile i like it i actually yeah. think that it's pretty cool and you get to see a little bit more of his costume. He looks pretty cool. Like I'm yeah. slowly getting excited for this movie, but I want to see what kind of tone they're going for whenever they release a trailer for it. I hope it's not like dark Batman. I hope they find a way to like make a Batman movie where it's not just. I hope feel like I don't want to feel wet watching it, like because it's like swampy and gross. I hope the cow has eyebrows on it, and it's a remake of the. A 60s TV show. <laughs> like, let's fucking do this. I, 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 sure. Yeah, dude. Bat shark repellent. Like, let's go. Okay. I think it won't be this one, but the next Batman will be campy as hell. I don't know. I I, don't I, know. I think this one looks a little dark. Yeah. Well, a little, dude. Like, every shot's been... Well, I mean, black like, white. To- tonal, tonally. I mean, it's literally every shot is black and red. It is Batman, too, so it's gonna be dark. Oh, it's Batman's like a, is dark. I could, it looks. I'm thinking maybe like a cartoonish version of like Nolan Batman. I don't know. Everything is red and black. I just want. To <laughs> black. Uh, Speaking of red and black, the bad guy for Falcon and Winter Soldier is possibly Omega Red. That'd be cool. No. I didn't hear about this until I read it now. <laughs> yeah, Breaking I, news. I didn't know about that, but cool. Like I like Omega Red. That'd be the first confirmed mutant, too, wouldn't it? Yeah, it yeah is like, isn't he on X Men? Uh, um, is he a mutant? I don't know. My first time seeing him I is in a so. X Men fighting game, like on the Super Nintendo. Yeah, he was in uh, X Men vs. Street Fighter, I think. As PlayStation. I think he was in. So he was a. He's like a major character in Wolverine stuff, so I can see him being. Yeah. Eh, I wouldn't say major, but he's he's one of his more like prominent villains, but like maybe not factoring so much into like he's not like Sabretooth. Like that's no. a major villain. 
But he's definitely part. He was part of. He's cool, dude. Omega yeah, Red's he's cool. cool. Omega Red. Like, see, I thought it was Omega Red when they first had Iron Man two with Whiplash. I was like, yeah. oh, is that Omega Red? And like, no, it's not. It's what, yeah, I mean, hopefully they like they differentiated enough from that. So. And thus he used knows? his armor. Wait, what? <clears throat> and thus it like Omega Red finds his stuff and starts using it. No, the the the. No, it needs to be different. He needs to have yeah. control over the tendrils, and it's got to be like a Russian, like some kind thing of connection tied, to like the Winter Soldier. Yeah, program. tied to that program, which is you know, kind of all. I, I, you know, we'll see. Tied Phase four is going to be weird, man. Yeah, we possibly even have what Henry Cavill as Wolverine is super into I'm, that. Yeah, I just yeah. heard that yesterday. He's like too big. Yeah, he's too big, but so was Hugh Jackman. They don't care. Yeah, but they could shrink him and. Pose. They took away his mustache. Uh, yeah, but let me saw that look. <laughs> it looked Earth. beautiful. Uh, yeah. He is a beautiful man. What else we got? Uh, Bob Iger is out as CEO of Disney. Yeah, that was like planned though, but it, I think it happened sooner than they initially reported. But you know, whatever. You just got. I'm tired of this. Bye. Yeah, he's like fucking Star Wars fans. The new guy, Bob. Chopak or Chop Chopak? I don't know. Something like His that. name's Bob. That's all I know. It's, it's another Bob. What about too many Bobs? What about Bob? Bob. 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 Burger. Um. Come on, say his I name. Know. I'm hoping they, they kind of shake up some stuff over there. Yeah. Uh, I think they're doing fine. Kathleen Kennedy. Give it to Favreau. No, I think they're Feige was. He's got something going. Was on. rumored to be taken over it, so. Yeah, I've heard that he's taken it over. Yeah, I know like, he has. He's producing, I think, a trilogy or something. Well, they announced the prequel stuff recent. Not like prequel, prequel, but prequels for the prequels. Yeah. Well, yeah, the books and High Republic. Yeah. I think that that High Republic stuff is going to introduce, like, be into films eventually. I heard it's we'll all see. gonna be books and comics. They need like initially. They can go back. Like that's the thing is I don't think they should go forward. They need to go back. Like yeah, there's so much crap that happens before anything. You can bring in new characters. Like you know, you you deleted most of the EU. Like just you know, do something or just. Other stories. I don't know. Star Wars. Yeah. Yeah, 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 no. Stop with Luke. Get over the yeah, Skywalkers. Sky, Skywalkers are, are God, that needs to be done. Yeah. Or like go f- like f- way farther into the future, like where they're all gone. Yeah. Like I, I don't know. I don't want any more Ray. I don't want any more Finn. <laughs> you know. Let's move I do, on. I do want that Obi Wan show. Yeah. Yeah. You should do that. Yeah. Yeah, because, oh, yeah, I've been watching Clone Wars still, so. Ah, oh, I still got to catch up on that one. It's really yeah, good. You do. Like, what are you in, season one still? One, uh, half, almost done with season one. Okay. It gets a lot better, just so you know. I haven't seen the new you season You can skip yet those because... Jar Jar episodes. They suck. Oh, uh, that, yeah. You don't realize it until you're in it, and then you're like, fuck. <laughs> There's <laughs> some coming up. Well, not coming up. There's some in, like, I think season four that I didn't see, and they did, like, what was it? There was like some really, really good episodes, and they did like two like Jar Jar episodes <laughs> back to back, and then they did two fucking C three PO episodes back to back, and I was like, the fuck. And then it got really good again after that. I was like, what the fuck was that? Like, <laughs> anyways, just come up and Jar Jar you up in the ass real quick. God, dude, it was so bad. You but you've like seen the, the current season, right? Uh, I haven't seen I'm the not, current season. No, I haven't no? seen the current season. I'm waiting for all of it to get released so I can sit and watch it all at once. I think I'll, I'll watch. I'll catch up until I get there, but then like I'll I'll, I'll watch it like <laughs> as it's released because you know I, I like that that weekly Mandalorian like that. hype that we got. It hurts me. No, I'm I'm fine with it releasing yeah. like episodically like that like. It fights that, like... That's how TV was meant to be watched. Yeah, like, it fights that just binge thing where it's like, oh, it's out. Like, I'm going to do that with Castlevania coming up. Yeah. Like, I fi- Oh, I finally saw season two. It's really good. Like, oh, 10, out of, 
10 out of 10. Right? Season 2, really? episode 7. Ugh. You need to watch Castlevania. It's so fucking it's good. so good. I just want to... Season 1? Like, eh? Season 1's good. Season 1's good. Season 2 is fucking phenomenal. Is that Ryan, admit Witcher? it. Admit it. Anytime you're watching it, just be like, you want a Bloodborne show so bad. Oh, dude, that's what I was telling you. Like, I think a Bloodborne anime by that team would be just, oh my god. Like, <laughs> so freaking good. Oh, and yeah, um, the was good. Yeah, I haven't watched that. That's really good. Uh, what else we got going on? Uh, Kazuhi... Hold on. Kazuhisha Hashimoto. Pause for edit. Yeah. Okay. See, I, can't, I can't say all of those Japanese names. Oh, he it's the creator of the Konami code. Passed away at age yep. 61. He's up, up, down, down. Up, left, right, right, left, right. B-A. 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 Because it works on my baby's video game controller toy. Mm. Yeah, it's an everything. Like, yeah. ESPN had a Easter egg with it where, like, unicorns and shit would pop out. Like, yeah, it's just, it's... It's one of those things where... Even a lot of people who don't play video games and stuff know of that code. Like, it, it transcended video games 30, somewhat. 30 um, lives in Contra. Oh, yeah. It's, it's you know, just... That's the thing it's most known for. Mm-hmm. Um, I made, a, like, little glasses for my groomsmen for my wedding. Mm-hmm. And, uh, you know, each one had, like, a little personalized message mm-hmm. uh, for their... You know, just, like, our relationship. And I made one for Ryan, and it actually had the Konami code on it. Yeah. Aww. Yeah. That's so. sweet. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Anything else? Uh, I think we touched what we needed to touch. Y'all yeah. want to touch anything else? What, uh, what about uh, we'll jump on uh, we'll jump on some Star Wars? We'll let Adrian get all. Uh, yeah, Adrian, go ahead. It, does okay, he, you've got. Does he have a piece of paper? No, you've got... No, but I, I kept this. Hold on. 30 seconds. Ready? Oh, wait. After you finish your drink. Not the whole thing. What's he, what's All right. Drink? Ready? Set. Go. All right. So Palpatine is a clone now. Like the one we saw in the movie. They release, they're rele- I don't think it's released yet, but like they're releasing the, the novelization of the last one. So he's a clone. Which, I don't know. So there's like a, like a vat of, of Snoke's. And like also a vat of like Palpatines like flopping around. <laughs> uh, his son, like you know, he's like a, his granddaughter was was Ray. So like his son was actually a clone of him that was like inferior, who I guess escaped or something. I don't know. I haven't read the book, but this is all what I'm hearing. And like his daughter was was Ray. So like I guess Ray is actually his clone daughter or something. All right, time. No, it's all stupid. There we go. That's all you really needed to say. Yeah. There it is. All right. So that's enough news. We're going to move on and do a new game that we have never played before. We're going to let Jason lead it off. Okay. The game, uh, we're kind of creating new segments, and we're trying to come up with some fun ideas to entertain you guys out there. So I created this thing called On the Spot. Basically, we are all going to take turns creating a category. And it's basically, if you played any drinking games, categories. You ca- you say the category, and you go taking turns until you can't name any more in that category. It's no specific order. It's not ranked or anything. It's just naming off things in that genre. For example, I'm going to say uh, science fiction movies, Ryan would say. <coughs> Aliens. Adrian? Alien 3. And then I would say uh, Predator but you cannot repeat a thing from before. So, y'all ready? Yeah. I'm going to start this who's off. Go, wait, uh, who's going first? So you're going to say it. So you then... have your... I'm going to say the category. Uh, okay. Let's just say, Adrian, you say the first thing. Then Ryan, then me. Yeah, the easiest one. You have, like, all of them. Yeah, but I don't know what he's going to say. Yeah, all right. <laughs> and... Wait, I'm yeah. not going to say the category yet. I'm going to build this up. Okay. Building it uh, up. Yeah. Ryan, did you, did you enjoy the Final Fantasy VII remake at all? Did I enjoy the Final Fantasy VII remake? Yeah, it was all right. Like it was fun um, okay. at times. Okay, so Jesse's really thirsty. We'll put that out there. <laughs> First thing that came to my mind is how cool the combat was. So, Adrian, you ready? Oh God, yeah. Video game weapons. A master sword. 
Buster Cannon. Oh, are you, not, are you not going? Oh, are yeah. Just the two of us? Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, I, shit. I, uh, the Fire oh, Flower. Shit. Oh, yeah, he's the Fire Flower. Is that a uh, weapon or a power-up, though? It's a weapon. Okay. Fireball appear- abilities. <laughs> Home run okay. bat. Uh, shit. Lightsaber. Yeah, it counts, yeah. but it's, it's weak. It's in so many video games. Go. Adrian, go. Uh, the Golden Gun. BFG 9000. Son of a bitch, I was just about to say that. Uh, Halo Pistol. The Halo Plasma Rifle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, I know all these, but I'm going to just um, freeze. The Rainbow Sword. Golden Gun. Oh, Adrian I just said Golden it. Gun. Did he already say Golden Gun? Yeah. 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 What, okay, I'm out. Uh, proximity of Mine. You're just going to go through all the gold nuts? Hmm, son of a bitch. Play this safe. Um, let's go with Moss Immune. Um, melee Punch. Does that count? No, but RCP90. Damn it. Oh, the Club. Kvostov. The uh, PP7. Hmm? Are you sure about that? PPK? <laughs> um, we're gonna go with the arm cannon. Samus. Samus's arm cannon. Uh, shovel? Shovel Knight? Okay. Plasma Cutter. Dead Space. Uh, Kane from, uh, Dark Tales. <laughs> <laughs> um, we'll go with the Ultima weapon. The slingshot from Zelda. Chainsaw. From everything. <laughs> but Doom, we'll go Doom. Uh, bomb from Zelda. Hookshot. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get away. I'm just. Spending time here. Uh, boomerang from Zelda. Fire rod. Uh, that was I mean, ten is seconds. It, is that time? <sighs> that yeah. was ten seconds. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I have like so a ton of them. I just want to like. It's hard round. to get them out. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the first like five that I thought of were named right off the bat. I'm like, oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> You just it's hard. Pick a game and like run through your just push yeah. a, a bunch of times. Scroll through your weapon. Yeah, I think we need to narrow it down to five seconds. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. that's yeah. the idea of it. Okay, okay. so so was that, all three of us will play then. Yes. Yeah, was that, okay, so was that like a practice round? That was a practice round. Okay, so you have the real one now? Yes. Okay, okay. No. Okay. No. <laughs> Y'all ready? Yeah. Adrian, you're going first, or Ryan, you want to go first? Adrian, I'll go first. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Finding game special moves. Do we have to say the move? Down forward yes. punch. Hadouken. Okay. You don't have to like do the input. Oh, yeah, okay. you don't have to put the input, just the move. Okay. So, so you use right, Hadouken. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Sure, can Dragon punch. Uh, get over here, spear. I went blank. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was time. Oh, wow. Tiger. Wow. Uh, Psycho Crusher. Tiger Uppercut. Tiger Knee. Psycho. Cr- did you say Psycho Crusher already? Yes, I did. Oh, damn it. I was. <laughs> <laughs> no. How are we failing on this? <laughs> okay, I won that round. Wow. All right, it's Ryan. It's a game, but I'm just uh, not Yeah, sure. well, it's hard on the spot well, because. Gonna... <clears throat> I thought you said spinning pile driver. No. Oh, well. I said, that's my lisp. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> All right. You create a category now. All right. Um, this one should be simple. And I'll go first since Adrian sure. went first. Yeah. All right. You ready? Uh, Super yeah. Nintendo games with Super in the title. Super Metroid. Super. <laughs> Star Wars. <laughs> All right, Super Scope 6. Uh, Super Empire Strikes Back. Super Return of the Jedi. Super Buster Brothers. 
Super Mario World. Uh oh. <laughs> Super Mario World Two, Yoshi's Island. Alright. Ooh. Um Oh no. Oh no. Super <laughs> It's that time? No, hold on. Su- oh, son That's of a bitch. How does that happen? <laughs> yeah. Super, Super Mario Kart. Super Mario Kart. Ghost. Damn it. All right. I'm out. Go. Yeah, Super Mario Kart. Oh, my God. <laughs> Super Contra. Super Mario All-Stars. Super Contra 3, by the way, but keep going. Wow. I was going to say Super Smash Brothers, but that's not... That is not... Uh, if they had that on Super Nintendo, I would have played the shit out of it. Oh, man, I had like four more lined up. Come on, Adrian. Go ahead, rattle them off. Super Castlevania? Yeah, four. Yeah, well, it's Castlevania four. Oh, wait, no, I didn't have any more. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Adrian. This is bad. <laughs> like, this should be like... You should be able to like shoot these yeah, out. Yeah, that's the point of it, though. That's why uh, it's on the like, It's it's difficult for the mind my, to think this stuff. That was my category, and I failed. So, <laughs> how I feel. You had Super Scope, and I'm like, oh, shit, that's my pick. Well, I, yeah, I tried to go obscure with some of them, and they didn't work. Super Bomber, man, damn it. All right, go ahead. Super Base is loaded. Oh, my God. <laughs> super Techno. Uh, yeah. Uh, Nintendo and Super Nintendo Mario games. Villains. Okay. Who's go- am I going first? You go first. Yeah. Hey, Bowser. Koopa Troopa. Goomba. Booster. Bullet Bill. Torpedo Ted. Uh, Smithy. Wiggler. Spiny. Charge and Chuck. Boo. Budsy Beetle. Goomba. I already said Goomba. Did you? That was my first one. Oh, fuck. All right. Well, I'm bad at this. Larry. Oh, here we go. Iggy. Wendy. Um, Morton Jr. No one said the best one. Oh, fuck. I'm out. I can't. I blanked. Roy. Ludwig. God dang it. Yeah, well, there we go. Yeah. Oh. God, what is that stupid cloud's name? I was trying to come up with that. I know it started with an L. Yeah. The the one throws the spinies. Yeah. All right. Uh, Smiley Angry Sun. Yeah. All right. Do you have have anything else you want to... I thought of Ninja Turtle characters. I don't know if you want to do that one. Shit. Ryan, go. <laughs> go right now. It's on the spot. Bebop. Yep. Rocksteady. Leonardo. Krang. Raphael. Donatello. Michelangelo. Splinter. April. Shredder. Shit. Uh, pass. <laughs> <laughs> General Trag. Fugitoid. Uh, the Neutrinos. Uh, one of them. What? <laughs> that doesn't count. Oh, oh, shit. Mondo I was, Gecko. I was trying to remember the fly guy's name. Uh, Ray Filet. Yeah, Ray Filet. Yeah. Mondo Gecko. Uh, Baxter Stockman. That's the fly guy. Yep. All right, so I won that one. All right. Yeah. Uh, WCW WWE wrestlers. Okay. Uh, Eddie Guerrero. Chris Benoit. Chris Jericho. Hulk. Hogan. <laughs> Bill Goldberg. <laughs> I was like stuck Sting. Uh, the Undertaker. Rowdy Rowdy Piper. Edge. The Ultimate Warrior. Ooh. Gangrel. What the shit? That's old. Raven. Uh. Steve. Ke- Kevin Nash. Yeah. <laughs> Steve Nash. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god okay you totally made me blink uh canyon scott steiner 
Uh, the Rock. Rick Steiner. Stone Cold Steve Austin. That's got to be time right there. Val Venus. Bam Bam Bigelow. Ray Mysterio. Ray Mysterio Jr. You knew that's what I meant. Ah, but his dad was a wrestler. Juventud Guerrero. Chapo Guerrero. Psychosis. Glacier. <laughs> uh, oh my god, the nature boy, Ric Flair. Oh shit. Uh... Woo, in my head. <laughs> <laughs> Jake the Snake Roberts. The Big Boss Man. Oh my god. Kane. The Undertaker. He's been said. I did see him. Oh, okay. Ah, I knew Maybe eventually we would just have a repeat. Uh, Randy Savage. Oh, much Man Randy Savage. Yeah. yeah. All right. Breakfast cereals. Tricks. Kicks. Fruit Loops. Cheerios. Checks. I mean, not Cheerios. The Apple Jacks. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Cocoa Krispies. Honeycombs. Frosted Flakes. Choco Krispies, the Mexican version. <laughs> Honey Smacks. Crave. Uh, life. Uh, honey Bunches of Oats. Cookie Crisp. <laughs> Rice Krispie Treat Cereal. Uh, regular Rice Krispie Treats. Wait. Wait. Rice Krispies. Rice Krispies. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you made me forget what I was going to say. Uh, Reese's Puffs. Uh, Twinkies. They have a cereal now. <laughs> I saw Ooh. it in the breakfast aisle. The Nintendo one with the Mario on one side and the Zelda on the other. You never seen that? I did, but you don't even know the name of it. Um, I remember the theme song. Captain Crunch. Nintendo Crunch with Berries. The cereal now. Uh, Total. Peanut Butter Crunch. Oops, all berries. Muselics. Muesli? <laughs> uh, grape nuts. <laughs> oh, gross. Oh, shit. Uh, Raisin Bran. Yeah, you're out. Ah. Fruity Pebbles. <laughs> Raisin Bran Crunch. Honey Bunches of Oats. I think I said that one. Oh, shit, I said it! I can't believe I repeated myself. Wait, you said what? I said that one. I said Cocoa Krispies, and then I said Cocoa Krispies again. But I think I got eliminated <laughs> myself before. Anyways, all right. Well, all that's right. enough of that. Yeah. All right. That's fun. So, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll come up with some more <laughs> stuff, you know, along those lines. Yeah. Here. Uh, and sorry for all the frustration of people just yelling out answers that we <laughs> didn't have. And, yeah. Mm-hmm. So. It's harder than you think. We're going to switch over now into some hype mode. What are you excited for? Uh, I'm looking forward to Jason coming down and visit us next week. Hell yeah. So yeah, Jason is going to come down and visit us uh, like the end of next week. We're going to actually record an episode with all three of us in the same room for the first time. It's going to ah. be cool. Yeah, so closet's about to get a little bit more crowded. And then we're also going to play uh, our next uh, segment of our Dungeons & Dragons story. And I get to meet... I'm going to meet Grayson. I'm excited about that. Yeah, you get to meet Grayson. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be great. And Adrian, uh, I think you'll get to meet Grace. You haven't met Grace. Yeah, you no. you get to meet Grace and Grace's son, Grayson. Who's also my son, Jason's son, Grayson. It's our names combined. That like just hit Carrie like two weeks ago. It was like, yeah, I did the same thing to me like a month ago. Kelly Grayson, was like, you Grayson, fucking Jason. idiot. <laughs> I was like, no, I literally had like a, a like a, whoa. It's our ship name. <laughs> and his middle name's Parker because of Spider-Man. Word. No. Oh. My dog's name is Parker. Cause it's because Spider-Man. of Spider-Man? <laughs> no, it's because of the streamer. Parker, Parker. Place. Yeah, yeah. I do things. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that's, that's going to be fun. I am excited for that. 
Mm-hmm. Castlevania season three, I already kind of mentioned it. I'm excited. Like that's, that'll probably be out the same day that uh, this episode is released. So like when you're done listening to this, go watch castle fucking vania. And then let's do this again. Get us those yeah. two downloads. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What about Adrian? Any good movies coming out? Uh, Black Widow should be coming out. Yeah, pretty soon. I'm Looking excited. forward to that. I'm super excited. We want to see what the what MCU is gonna do after yeah. Endgame. I, mean, yeah. I, I love Taskmaster. Taskmaster is such a cool character, and they're finally bringing him over. Yeah, hopefully they do him justice. I hope they don't kill him. Like that's lock- what they need to do is to stop killing the, the villains. villains. Yeah, they this dude needs to just get locked away. Well, they didn't kill the guy from Civil War. He's come into Falcon and Winter Soldier. Yeah, I mean that's good. Like that's yeah. they need more of that because they've killed off a bunch of pretty good villains and now uh, Ultron was in some VR, VR thing. So yeah, it's and me technically Thanos snapped away, wasn't killed. Yeah, but I mean he's dead in two timelines. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, like I know uh, Onward is coming out. I think it's actually out now, Probably, right? I think this. Week. This comes out Friday. I think, I think it comes, comes out, out tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Uh, like they've started doing that, but yeah, I'm I'm excited for that. It's gonna make me cry. Like yeah, like Pixar. <laughs> you're, you go there, you're gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. So uh, yeah, and it's about like a father and son relationship and stuff. So it's just like gonna brutalize me. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm not ready. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be rough. Um, any other any other like movies? I mean, my my thing is like, Late, later on Godzilla vs Kong. I'm excited for that. Yeah. See, my thing is, like, I just want the Dune trailer. Like, I know the movie's a little ways away, but just keep, like, when that trailer drops, like, I don't know what, like, what I'm going to be doing, but, like, I'm going to stop whatever that is, and I'm going to fucking just go somewhere and just focus in on that. Like, just, I can't wait. Like, I think it, the hype is, like, it's starting to bubble up. You, I saw, like, a meme about mm-hmm. Doom coming up, and, like, yeah. Um, yeah. So it, it, People are just trying to get excited. Yeah, I'm really excited for Dune. It's it's Denny Villeneuve is is a fucking master. So but yeah, I mean I'm just really excited for that. It's like for, for movie wise, like that's the next movie I'm like super excited for. Like yeah, I want to see Onward. Yeah, I want to see Black Widow. But like Dune, Dune man. Like if he does this right, like holy shit, so good. What about video games? Any good video games around? Oh, yeah. Doom Eternal. Like, the more and more, like, press coverage that is getting, like, previews and um, embargoes being lifted on certain features, like, the multiplayer, like, the battle battle zone or battle mode? What is it? Battle mode? I think? I don't know. Whatever. Uh, the, like, where two people are, or whatever, the demons, and there's, like, one just overpowered, like, Doom Slayer, like... That sounds like so much fun, mm-hmm. um, because it's it, it it seems built for friends like to play. Mm-hmm. Like I don't think I'm gonna go online in like a ranked lobby and like all that bullshit. Like I just want to be like, hey Jason, hop in, and then we're just gonna have fun like playing that. Like it just seems fun versus right. you know built you for. Ass- you assume I will not be helping my animal critters create my fantasy home in Animal Crossing at that day. Yeah, but, you know. <laughs> that's that's such a mean thing for me. Doom Eternal and Animal Crossing come out the exact same day. I love, though, that those two, like, communities are, like... Oh, yeah, they're... Like, embracing each other and, like, making memes together and, like, supporting... That's so cool. Like, I don't know. I love that. Yeah, even the creators, I think, have done a little bit of goofiness. Yeah, they of course. You're, you're like cross-promoting they... each other's games. Like, Yeah, they... They had, like, the Animal Crossing, like, art of the Doom guy picking up a spine out of the ground. Mm -hmm. I found a spine. Oh, so, also, uh, Doom 64 comes out the same day as Doom Eternal. And that, like, if you never played Doom 64, it's so freaking good. Yeah, I think of that. I remember renting that. I remember, yeah, I remember renting that and just, like, that was all I did that weekend. Like, I took a total of zero showers (laughs) <laughs> that weekend because all i did was play that game and eat. how's that different from your normal weekends <laughs> so also resident evil 3 like 
Um, Again, if you haven't played the Resident Evil... They keep showing Resident... Nemesis. They keep showing Nemesis, and I'm yeah. so pumped. If you haven't played Resident Evil 2, the remake for that, you really need to. It is so good. I'm sorry. So good. You really uh-huh. need to. Rent it from your video store. <laughs> they don't have it. But they have tons of Call of Duty, World War, World of Wars, or can whatever. Can you make like, requests for them and stuff? Yeah, I'll see what I can do. I yeah, the Re- Resident Evil 2 Remake is so... It's always they, on like, sale, too. I just need to get so, it. Yeah, it's like it's 20 so bucks this week. Yeah, dude. I, just please. It's so good. And then maybe Final Fantasy VII. Like, I'm kind of hyped, but... I'm skeptical. <laughs> I'm uh, hyped and concerned at the like equally at the same time. I feel so torn. I I, I can totally wait for reviews on that. Like, it's like episodic. I'm not even. Yeah, it's episodic, but they haven't announced what the next episode is or how they're going to be releasing it or if it's even going to be the same type of game. And I'm afraid it's going to be, be like a very linear story, and they're not going to let us do like. Final Fantasy VII stuff where you're like chocobo raising and well, playing in the like, golden saucer. This game has a ton of stuff like that because they have to pad it out because you're not you're. This game is really just the beginning of the game because Final yeah. Fantasy VII doesn't really kick off until you leave Midgar. Exactly, and that's why I'm like, okay, well, this is called the Final Fantasy VII remake, but it's the remake of the prologue. So. We'll see. Uh, I can wait for reviews. Uh, hopefully it was good. Like I said, the demo was fun. I liked the kind of real-time combat and menu-based, you know, com- like combat the way they did. It was much better than Final Fantasy XV. I've never played Kingdom Hearts, so I can't speak for the comparisons there. It's the exact same as Kingdom Hearts. It's the exact same? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, again, that didn't really matter to me. It's, I think it's the same Kingdom team for the most part. Yeah, Nomura, right? Tetsuya Nomura? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. Like, hopefully it's good, and I can get my Final Fantasy VI remake. That'll never happen. It'll come out the same day as the Chrono Trigger, Bren. Mm, I think that's less likely, to be honest. Yeah. Um, (laughs) So, uh, also for TV, I'm excited for The Boys, season two. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Did you ever watch, watch that, Adrian? No, me? No, I, I I gotta watch that one. Yeah, you do. It's really it good. It's really good. Yep. I watched the whole show in a day. Yeah, it took maybe like three, just because I, I, it was during the summer, so I was busy at work. I had a day um, off, and I just started it in the morning, and next thing I know, it was the last episode. I'm like, okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, the Last yeah, of Us I mean, Part Two. Of, like, there's a lot of good stuff this year. This is gonna be a good year. Yeah, Last of Us Part Two, Cyberpunk. Like, there, there's, there's some good games still come out. Next gen consoles, man. Like, we're, we're close. We're there. We're like seven months, seven, eight months away from. Yeah, about eight months away, or more. You think like Nintendo even, will do it? Like, or, no, they're gonna hold yet. out for a while. They'll, they may do an update of the Switch at some point, but um, they, they did they just released light. that. The light. A lot, yeah. So we'll see what they do, like if they do an HD, you know, upscale version or whatever. But um, I don't think Nintendo, 5, Nintendo Series really X? doesn't have to. No, not yet. They're their own thing. I think that Nintendo's <laughs> is okay with being the second console family zone. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the other thing I'm I'm pretty excited for is Warhammer. Like I might be able to actually play a game like. It's like at some point, like I've been just so into the paint your Marines. We'll play when I get there. The I mean, they don't have to be painted to play, but you know, um, yeah, they do. If you want to be like that, yeah, just I'm 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 so enjoying the hobby and lore aspects of it that like I haven't even like I've watched some videos of (laughs) don't even know how to play the game. (laughs) Yeah, like strat. Well, I watched some videos like strategies and and just uh, battle reports of like you know people playing it and it looks you know like it would be a lot of fun um or it is a lot of fun you know so i need more d6s yeah you need a lot the like my, i'm gonna have to get a ton because some of the my units uh have, like, sh- i read sport. a thing just use your use your phone well you know to roll that's so satisfying because a lot of my units re-roll ones like if i roll a one i re-roll that oh, okay so it's hard to do that with the phone anyways um 
yeah, some of my units will shoot like 18 something dice, and that's just one unit that's in a squad or whatever. So I'll shoot a fuck ton of. We have like a little tub of dice. Yeah, they're they're all d sixes though. They don't use yeah. twenties or anything. Where you need that swan from pa- uh, Pack South again? No, Ch- uh, Chessex sells like cube of them where there's like a fuck ton of them in there. Anyways, um, yeah, I mean. I want a new Farsight model. The I, I looked at the old one, um, and it's resin, and it's like r- apparently like just real shitty like shitty build quality on it. So the fact that they just kind of buffed them and put a new thing in their uh, module update, like hopefully he gets a new model. So yeah, be- I think it's currently like the tower fighting against those like gen gene people. Oh, the gene stealer cult. Yeah. Yeah, those are pretty cool too. Um, anyways, they're all pretty cool. Yeah, like Fuck I mean, you, it's, Warhammer. It's Damn be... it, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's it just seems like it's gonna be a good year for entertainment and nerd stuff. Like, I'm excited about you know playing Minecraft with with Ben. Like, he's super into that still. Uh, the other day he was talking about how he wanted to play hide and go seek with me in Minecraft, and I was like, yeah, we'll play, and then. The next day comes, and he, like, loads up the world or whatever, and there's, like, a big, like, thing he built on the ground that spells out Ben versus Dad. And I was like... Oh, my God. Like, that was just, like, such a, like, good dad moment. Like, it was... It's, like, mental screenshot. I'm really excited for Grayson's first year. Yeah. Like, he's a year old. Yeah, that's crazy. April 1st. I'm so excited to like hold him and like make fart noises on his tummy and like. Oh yeah, you want to know what the he's gotten to the point where he's uh, independent. And he doesn't like be held anymore. Uh, Dude, it just I'll, gets worse. That sucks, <laughs> Uncle Ryan. You know, Uncle, he's gonna have to just deal with the belly farts of Uncle Ryan. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's he, a parent he, thing. He'll, he'll go nuts with yeah. all his yeah. aunts. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, I mean, <sighs> it's it's gonna be funnier, man. Uh, you know, I think it's my wife and I's ten ten year anniversary. Like, ah. It's going to be good, good times. It's going to be so... 2020 is going to be a good year. Let's all avoid the coronavirus and World War Three, and we'll be okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's going to be fun. Like, I'm excited to play some more Minecraft with, with my son and um, have him build a bunch of uh, cool stuff in there and show it to me. So I think that's uh, I think that's that about wrap. wraps it up, though. Oh, and on such a happy note. All right. Well, <laughs> well. Uh, where where can these fine folks find us? Adrian, go. Uh, they can find us on Podbean and iTunes and Spotify. Next Gen Retro Man. We can email us at nextgenretroman at gmail dot com. Instagram at nextgenretroman. Twitter at nextgenretroman. Facebook. I think we still have a Facebook. Mm-hmm. Yes. All right. Facebook dot com slash nextgenretroman. Yes, yeah, he asked that because I've been talking about deleting my Facebook. Page. And I'm so working on our YouTube page. Sweet. And yeah. we're going to eventually get a Next Gen Retro Man website. <laughs> I'm yeah. saying that, but I'll probably say that like years from now, too. So 2021. Yeah, like a production. coming soon sign. We just got to make it look like a like GeoCities like, <laughs> with like an old like visitor counter at the just bottom. Put, like the dancing baby it's gonna be yeah, in MySpace. from like the 80s or 90s. That's or all it needs to be. It's just a MySpace page from back in the day. <laughs> yeah, we can, we can play some, some music on it. Send us some emails on Sigmund Ideas. That'd be really nice. Gives us some ideas of what y'all want to hear. And send us in emails of what you'd like to see on our YouTube page. I have some ideas I'm going to throw towards these guys and see what they think as well. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. One guy, one jar. Mm. Oh. That's our only video on our YouTube page. No. Nope. All right. Okay. <laughs> no. Okay. Vetoed. All right. Fair enough. What's in the jar? Have Instead you not? Ne- <laughs> have you never seen that, Jason? I have not. Don't stay pure. <laughs> <laughs> sweet, sweet Jason. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Just please. Uh, no one ever look at that video. <laughs> Not just Jason. <laughs> like, just no one see that. It's one O N E guy. It's a, is that Momo? Uh, <laughs> no more Momo uh, scares for me though. That's that's okay. positive. Anyways, that's good. All right. Anyways, good night everybody. Bye. Wash your hands. Bye. Yes, wash your hands.
Use hand sanitizer. Yeah, just wash your hands. <coughs> and cover your mouth when you cough. Oh, shit. 